But if they ask me a question about Lingyi, the, the B word will come out, right? Huh? Basti! Hello? My name is Jay Kishan. I'm here to answer your bloody questions. Looks like y'all want to know so many things. For what? If you had to choose a wife from Wah Banana, who would you choose? Lingyi. She has the money. How did you start your acting career? I was serving coffee on set first. I was working behind the camera before I went in front. How does it feel being good looking? This is a great question. You see this confidence? It's because I'm good looking. You think if I look like Nick or anybody else in Wah Banana, this confidence will come out? Not at all. <laughs> Hi guys. You. you can try lah, ugly man. I've been getting this question since day one of Wah Banana. Are you Indian? Abu Den? I am born and bred in Singapore. But I do know the Indian national anthem by heart. Kiss, Mary kill. Jason, Nick, Thomas. I would kill Jason. I would marry Thomas and kiss Nick. What do you want? You're standing there, something's going to happen, is it? Yes. What? Don't kill me. He's a 30-year-old man, but he speaks as though he shops at Kitty Palace. First impression of Lingyi. What a bitch. No lah. <laughs> you see? You see, it's not me, you know. It's who I work for. <laughs> Honest impression, I thought, I thought she was a very sassy, sexy woman. Hey, later, I'll let you know how much she paid me to say that. If you could go somewhere, where would you go? Home. Actually, it's Hawaii. I want to go to Hawaii. They shot Jurassic Park there, so I want to see all the sets and all that. It's fantastic. If you could switch bodies with a member of Wah Banana, who would you choose? <laughs> hmm. Audrey. So I can go out there and have some fun. You know Audrey always does this. Touch my body. Did anything weird happen to you on an MRT? This bunch of kids came up to me and said, Wow, you're so famous, you take MRT. Uh. What is wrong with our public transport system? You think I made a lot of money, is it? You think my banana's paycheck very big, is it? I could use a race. <coughs> I could use a race. How did you join Wah Banana? Actually, this question got a lot of memories. Yeah. I was filming a video and then there was this Chinese lady there that day on shoot who I never knew. I didn't even know Wah Banana at that time. The next day, I got a text from her saying, It would be my honour to have you on Wah Banana. Quote and unquote. I was so fake. I'm sorry. It would be my honour was the starting few words. I have the text. Rachel Quack, I can DM you this text. How does poop taste? How does your mother taste? What is your phobia? I hate cockroaches. I cannot do cockroach. Can I tell the story? Can I tell the story of why, why I don't like cockroaches? Last time, my family had no money to afford Lego and my grandmother would keep uh, cloth packs in a Tupperware and I would take that and I put them together and make it into a toy. I needed more. So I went to the kitchen and then I saw this big basket of uh, cloth packs. The whole basket started to shake and then I dropped it out of fright, right? And it was a whole family of cockroaches in there. I was just covered in roaches as I was a kid and then freaked out. Lor. What was it like the first day you joined Wah Badana? Do you remember my first episode, anybody? I was a caveman. I was very nervous. I didn't know what to do. I didn't know whether I was funny or not. But we managed to pull off the episode. And I think that's about it. I hope I answered your questions. It's uh, quite a bit. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. What more you want? You want to ask some more questions today? Go away. Find something better to do.